Hey people, it's Nice Talk. I'd like to thank Kishel B for telling me about this story. So this is the number of black inventors video. This is from blackengineer.com. The National Society of Black Physicists announced the death of Dr. George R. Carafas. The National Society of Black Physicists has released a statement on the death of Dr. George Carafas. A staunch supporter of the organization, the award-winning astrophysicist, passed away on December 26. He will be remembered as an amazing scientist, engineer, professor and mentor. The National Society of Black Physicists said that Dr. Carafas is considered the inventor of the ultraviolet camera spectrograph. He also invented the camera that took the first images of space. His work has been instrumental in the field of astrophysics. Dr. Carafas was given many awards for his work, including a National Medal of Technology and Innovation by President Obama. Dr. Carapaz was a visiting assistant professor in the research fields of atmospheric physics and astrophysics at Howard University, teaching and mentoring future generations of black physicists. Dr. Carapaz was an NSBP fellow and a staunch supporter of this organization. His passing is a tremendous loss to the physics community and the NSBP. Details concerning his memorial are forthcoming. Astrophysicist George Carapaz was born in 1939. He developed an ultraviolet spectrograph, launched a sounding rocket in 1970 that confirmed the existence of intercellular hydrogen and a similar device that was placed on the moon by Apollo 16. When the trailblazing physicist won the Black Engineer of the Year Award BIA, for technical contribution in 1987, Dr. Carafas was one of 40 black scientists and engineers working at the Naval Research Laboratory in his U.S. Black Engineer magazine citation by Bayer Selection Committee. Carafas was praised for technical contributions to the U.S. Navy and Defense Department's space program and his development of man's first moon-based space observatory, which was carried aloft by the Apollo 16 astronauts and placed on the moon. His experiment, a far ultraviolet camera spectrograph, permitted humans to observe the terrestrial upper atmosphere from the lunar surface for the first time and to observe celestial objects in and the interplanetary medium. NASA's Skylab 4 used the Carafas developed far ultraviolet camera to photograph two NASA sponsored rockets flown from White Sands missile range to obtain invisible images of Comet Halley. These rockets along with two other forms that two others flown at the same time while among only a few U.S.-sponsored space experiments to collect data on the comic. Carafas earned his bachelor's in aeronautical engineering, a master's in nuclear engineering, and a Ph.D. in aeronautical engineering, all from the University of Illinois. Born in Cincinnati, Ohio, he moved to Chicago with his family when he was 12. He was an active member of the National Technical Association. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. Please comment, rate, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave this and some other sources in the description. I'd like to... Have peace.